That makes sense. We got a lot of trucks passing, so let's be a little bit careful. Damn, four in a row. Hello everyone, welcome back to Ghost Recon Breakpoint. Jumping in in the same exact spot where we ended the last video, picking up that M4. Almost, well, seeing some pretty weird stuff. I don't, I really don't even know what we saw that last episode, but we were making people dead alive and people were flinging out of cars after shooting them. Uh, we were doming people through stairs. It was, it was some good stuff. So we're going to take the helicopter from this location and try to find ourselves a new spot we can go to. Looks like the sun, I believe, is coming up in this location. So let's go ahead and look around. We've really got to start getting these behemoths, but I'm not really close to... Uh, their skill level, so I kind of got to get up a little farther before we uh, dive into adventures like that. Ooh, those Wetworks cold gloves look pretty cool. And it doesn't look like a pretty big place, but that's quite the distance. Well, that's not too far. 3200 XP is a side mission. Bring 10 metal parts to Ak Akamai. He's in the Scott Homestead. Oh, maybe that's why there's only one thing there, because there's no one we have to actually fight. It's just uh, kind of like something that's there. So I'm going to go ahead and look around really quick, see if uh, we can find anything good that I haven't really picked up. As you can see, anything that has like that white check mark usually indicates that I've been to that location and got something from there, uh, which means that unless something pops up that doesn't have a check mark, uh, for instance, like that, you can see the Desert Eagle is available at this location, but that's a pretty big compound just for a Desert Eagle. So what I'm thinking is maybe we can move off into some areas that I haven't been into. Uh, I've just got to try to find... We want to make sure we don't go into anything too crazy as well, too, because then we're going to be looking at uh, some pretty intense areas when it comes to what these guys' ranks levels are and we want we don't want to get too crazy so i'm going to go ahead and fly uh to this new location we're going to see what we get here and we'll be right back we are pulling up to our destination that place down there looks really cool it has like three big buildings but this place has a ton of stuff uh which is low uh, located really close to that one so i'm going to park right here land the helicopter right here this is more of a uh, snowy atmosphere, but I'm going to go ahead and keep in my outfit to really keep us set in stone and unless, uh, I don't know, unless it doesn't do well for us and we keep getting easily spotted. Uh, but let's show you guys what exactly we got at this location here. Uh, it is going to be a UMP, which is a really awesome submachine gun, a shotgun, which is the SAS G12, and then the pistol, which is a CSFP. And then the Oakley SI Assault Gloves. Uh, we're also going to have a Regal, Regal Blossom equipment, which I don't know what that is at all, and 1,500 skull credits. So I'll take it in a new helicopter, so that works for me. Uh, so what we're going to do, as always, is I'm going to go ahead and send up a drone. Uh, we're going to tag some people as much as we can, and then we'll be right back. Okay, that was a close one. These guys just passed, but they didn't see me in these rocks, so I guess our camouflage works. Uh, right now we have every single target uh, mapped up. And I just want to look at our gear level really quick because these guys are 131. I guess I'm in the relatively close range as them. Uh, I could be a little better. I could throw on this. But then again, it's not an MK3. So my MK3 really will mess them up. Or my Mark III, uh, rather. Um, so we're going to start picking. Now this place, I was looking at it over the drone, and it's a little different because it's 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 tight quarters. It's not like it's a big uh, facility or whatnot. So if I shoot someone, for instance, a good example is there's a lot of two units walking around. If I shoot one of those, obviously the other one needs to be shot quickly. Um, and then on the roof, there's just a ton of guys uh, that are sitting together. This guy, if I shoot his backpack, he just blows up. I got to get off of here, dude. This is bad. Get on the ground, dude. Get on the ground. Okay, this should be a little more comfortable spot. The guys that are up on the hill up there should just drive past me. I parked the helicopter off to the side, so we really shouldn't be blocking or disturbing anyone. Uh, I say we work with what we got so far, so I'm going to probably go 
This guy's by himself. There's a one guy that can see him. If I shoot this guy off this roof, he could be seen by multiple people. But I think our best bet is to do this guy. Okay, one target down. We got to be wary about the guy that's near the helicopter because I have a feeling he's going to be able to see his partner that was just shot and leaning against that fence. Uh, which, if that's the case, then it's going to make people scramble a little because I know they got to... Oh, there's another one? Great. So there's two near the helicopter, not just one, which is going to make things a little difficult. And we've got two that are actually walking around near the helicopter. So if I take anyone out out there on ground level, uh, it's pretty much going to ruin a lot of stuff. These guys are 179. They're pretty close. We see all the double units. That's just absurd, dude. So I think our best bet would be to possibly get these guys on the roof. I could probably do one at a time. Beautiful shots. Okay, let's get a reload really quick. A body has been found. Someone just found a body here. Okay, shit. Shit. Okay, little, little sloppy there, but they don't know where I'm at. But people are going to start... Oh, sh oh, shit. We got the guy that was about to see us. Uh, I think we're going to need to get a better position here because I've seen better and I've been in better and I feel like anyone is going to really have the chance to see me here. Ah, oh, shit. And this really isn't good. Oh, he ran into that. He ran into that. Okay, I got 80, 80 rounds left with the, uh, with the sniper. I'm going to start going for dome shots if I can. Anything I can, if anyone's sticking out or anything like that. Okay. Everyone else is going to be pretty hunkered down. Again, they don't know where I'm at. If I can make my way in there, I could probably do a ground assault because we've lost our advantage on the, uh, up here. And we're going to just go in for it. We're probably going to slide. That is a lot of snow we're kicking up. Okay, we're going to make sure we have uh, silencers on all of our weapons. Okay, I just took that off. Didn't mean to do that. Come on, put it on. I got to get this uh, assault, uh, this thing gone. There we go. How did I not hear that explode? I have absolutely no idea. People are probably going to start moving because I haven't had any bullets, uh pin them down so they they'll either start moving or they'll become uncautious okay I just sprayed and prayed I have a visual detection from these two guys one down okay they let them know I'm here so I'm moving in we're doing assault mode and they're moving in towards me Good stuff. We're going to try to move in and see if we can stay on an uh, opposite premise from them. Like, kind of just as they move around one building, I'm going to move around the other side. Which will just allow me some uh, chance to make it through this. I got a heavy right here. I don't know if anyone heard that. Ooh, level XP upgrade, even though I don't think that really does anything. Fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, they're going in through the building. Okay, they're on the other side of this building right now. I think I'm going to have to move in towards them. I'm going to stay on the outside since for whatever reason they went right through the middle. Oh, they're searching that last area. I think I'm going to grenade them. Peace, bitches. <laughs> Look at them all. Oh, I thought that grenade was going to get someone. They all dove out of there. There we go. Light those suckers up. They're moving in. Why are they going through the middle of that house? That makes no sense. Yep, 
Okay, I think he saw me go in there just a tea bit. Oh, I can't get in there? I gotta grab one of them. Where'd he go? Okay, that made them super weary about what's going on. This pistol is not really high, uh, high level, so we gotta be a little bit weary. Dude, them in the running through this building, man. Give it a break, bro. Oh, shit. Now he knows I'm here. Oh, he's got a shoddy. He almost took my face off on that one. Okay, one more guy coming down this center here. I'm gonna be ready for him. Coming right into the front door. There you go. I don't know if that's everyone, but, uh... That's everyone over here. Okay, since we got everyone, I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick, um... Pick up of all the items in this area. Or at least all the ones that are kind of congested, except for the one near the helicopter, because we're going to take the helicopter. Although, I did shoot out the helicopter several times, and hit the helicopter several times. We've made it to this location that I was showing you earlier. These, This place has, like, huge buildings. It's absolutely insane. So I'm going to show you exactly what's at this location. They got a ton of stuff here, which is cool. It's going to be the HTI sniper rifle, the KSG-12, which I believe is a shotgun, Fingerless gloves, steel-toed boots, and USB tactical. Uh, we've got collectibles up the wazoo here in 25 scale credits. So, you guys know the drill. I'm going to go ahead and send up a drone uh, since we're nice and tucked away. We're going to get these guys marked up. And instead of doing a sniper, since these buildings are just ridiculous, I think I'm going to go ahead and move up for a ground assault submachine gun. Why are they standing in a row? They're just all standing on the catwalk here. I, re I really don't know what that was about. That's a little concerning if you ask me. We're getting them marked up though. They got some snipers, so we're probably going to have to take out the snipers with a uh, sniper rifle ourselves so we stay safe and they don't see us or anything. There is an absolute shit ton of guys here, so we should probably... I'm going to just spend some time getting these guys mapped up and we'll, we'll be right back. Okay, so we've got people marked up, but we have a little bit of an issue. They saw my drone, and that seems to be the death of me at this moment. Uh, we've got one more guy who's straggling around trying to search for his guys that went up here looking for someone. And he's down, he's down. So let me get this guy that's over here that heard my gunshot. There we go. Okay, now I can control the area. So let's go ahead and get these guys. Get what I can where I can. They called in reinforcements, and those were the guys I was dealing with, were the reinforcements. But now we should be good to take out the guys. I don't want to get that guy and have him fall off the roof. He just fell off the roof. Bam. Yep. Just spot. Son of a gun. That was, uh, I mean, shit, that's the mechanics of Hitman right there, though. If they fall off the, okay. Okay. That's when you know you're dealing with a lot of guys here. We got a guy all the way down here. Again, I need to get what I can. Uh, especially if they're all alerted. I was supposed to just get the snipers, but uh, sometimes that doesn't work like that. So, we had to do what we can. Let me get this uh, truck that's running around. Oh, it was. I don't know where it went. It went down, I think, or something. It's somehow... Oh, it's underneath the uh, bridge here. That makes sense. We got a lot of trucks passing, so let's be a little bit careful. Damn, four in a row. Four in a row. Wow. That was sad. That was sad for all of them. Okay, I think we got some more guys walking around, but the rest are going to be behind pretty big buildings, so we're probably going to have to move in there. If we just go submachine gun... Uh, we should be good to, you know, clear them out. We'll have an assault rifle for guys that are a little bit farther. Uh, and then the submachine gun for close quarter. And if shit gets really... Motherfucker. That was, that was almost... Ah. Uh. Okay, I'm making them run again, though. So that's, that's good on my end, because I will be able to get them. 
Got him. He's gonna do that same stuff his boy just did. Ah, I missed. Okay, truck's on the move a little. We gotta be wary because this guy's in a... I think the truck's stuck. We gotta just get it right now. Okay, we got it a little. We couldn't do too much to it. I think this guy's heroing it. Yeah, he's literally heroing it. He, he was running up the hill. Okay, that thing has a lot of armor. It's injured, though. Wow, that thing is injured, but it's still going. <laughs> Where are you going, bro? One more. There we go. I was getting a little concerned because it says it didn't see me, but it was coming right towards me. I don't think it could have made a straighter line towards me in any direction. Like, that was not good. All right, we're going to move in. Let's go ahead and get the... Uh, the ump back on. We'll wait for this truck to pass and we'll move in. Oh, I think I see a heavy's head from over here, but there's nothing I could do since we've already uh, swapped to the ump. Uh, so let's go ahead and get the submachine gun. Oh man, I should have got that. But screw it, we'll get it at the end. We still got a ton of guys to get. And we'll do a victory lap and go collect all of our stuff. Actually, we didn't have ump on. Now we have the ump on. There we go. Okay, hopefully we can get some close quarter stuff with these guys. I think they're still at pretty far lengths, but at the end of the day, we should be able to... This thing has no recoil, so we should be pretty good. Well, we got to get up a level. This thing is huge! Holy shit, and we still don't even have everyone mapped. We got the data storage center. As long as we move somewhat stealthy, we should be good. There'll be a lot of guys up here. We got hostiles. Move your ass. He got hit a little. What you gonna do, big guy? They still don't know what's going on. Okay, good. You're cool. Okay, one down. Okay, we're bad. We're bad. I'm gonna try to hold it as best as I can right here. Oh, heavy, heavy, heavy. He's down. I gotta move up and clear a little. There's way too many guys to this left. Oh, shit, and a sniper. Who's firing down upon me, so that's going to be fun to get him. Okay, he's down. Okay. Some, uh, they're, they're after, they're having to funnel. Which is not working well for them, clearly. Look at them all bri bricked up there. Around this left side. I'm going to just get him as I come around this corner. Ah! Should have got him. I can't even see him over there. I should take the silencer off. Oh! <laughs> Six rounds left in my submachine gun. Got the. At least I got the heavy. Alright, we're taking the uh, silencer off. What is going on, dude? I'm trying to change my fire rate, but it's not working. There we go. I also tried to get out of first person there, because we're a little too close quarters to be doing that. That's just not how it works. This is uh, not what I was expecting. 
especially when I was trying to disuse the ump and get in there. Look at all the guns they've dropped, though, in that little tight sector. Okay, we got two snipers that are just chilling. A few more guys that haven't been marked up that are probably making their way towards me right now. We got a gun. We got a heavy gun. Oh, shit. I can't see where he's shooting from. We're gonna have to use this. Oh, we don't have a sniper right now. Okay, since we're out of ammo on the ump, let's go ahead and go back to... We just need any type of sniper and I need a higher level to better. Oh my god. Wow, one shot kill on that. I don't even know how that's possible. I did miss horribly for uh, most of those shots there, which was not impressive. But at least it was one shot kill when we finally got down to it. So that's all that matters. Oh, that guy's going to be a shit show to get to. And of course he dropped a yellow. Or no, it's a purple. Uno mas, uno mas. Where is he? I see his light. Stay out of the open. Back up! Why was- holy shit! What was that? You have a firearm! Shoot it! I have no idea why he just did that, but that was so stupid. He had all that time that he just ran up on me to actually shoot me. And he didn't. What a wasted opportunity right there. Totally not worth it. We were messing him up with the shotgun too. Or this uh, sniper rifle. I don't know if it's possible to get on this roof, and this guy dropped some type of purple something, so... I mean, if he got on the roof, I'm sure there's a way I can get on the roof. We're gonna have to find out. I see catwalks and stuff, but I'm just not sure if that's... ...really the case. I like how they can get on the roof, but... ...it is not possible for you to get on the roof. I don't I can't even get in these fucking buildings. Yet there is... ...mega crates in them. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is going to be so much fun to go through these. I can see it now. See, I don't know why they maze it out like this. <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Okay, it looks like we're going to need a body to get into this room. So, if I could find a dead body, which there should be someone around here. I remember taking, there we go. We're going to have a little bit of a walk, but in the end of the day, at least we'll get uh, ammo and all that stuff. That's kind of what we're going to need. So here's a fun fact. If you guys haven't know or have don't know, if there's any locked doors that have, you know, a skill cred, skill credit, skill point, uh, you know, a lockbox or a personal drop, even though I, I doubt there would be a personal drop in a locked room. Um, this is how you get into the rooms. You got to take a dead body and walk up to the door and then it unlocks it because they have the ability to get in those rooms. Unlike us. So I will demonstrate that right now. So this is going to be a locked room. Which unlocks. And we have access to all this stuff in here now. It's uh, usually not any crates or anything like that. One time there was a crate and it wasn't even anything like that good. But it's just a fun uh, thing to know how to get in there in case you really need to up, uh, upgrade your stuff or kind of get into a room. Okay, I was wondering where that crate was. Looks like it's going to be down below. They See, they should have just put that one in the room. If you're going to already have to spend time getting in there, you might as well just slap that one in the room. Make it a little difficult, because that's the 2,500 skull credits that you can't even fucking spend it on in the, anything in the first place, so... I'm curious if I can get to the roof, or if it's just going to crap out and not allow me to. Oh, this place is huge. Holy crap. I don't know if it's even worth it. Whoa, that was weird. Playing this game as much as I do, I definitely see all the glitches. Uh, you know, when you play a game incrementally, you don't really see too much. Uh, but when you play it this much, that's not how it works. Try to get what we can. Okay, I think we're good in here. We can get out of here. Uh, we got a few more crates on the yonder. 
I don't think I'll be able to get, um, I got one over there I could probably get. I don't think I'll be able to get that weapon from the guy that dropped it on the roof, which is a little bit unfortunate. I think they should have had a better way to access the ones that you can't really get to. They figured it out with the drones, because if you shoot the drones and you get a weapon from the drone, they kind of just, um, have it just immediately spawn on you, which is kind of nice. Unlike, you know, the personal drops, they'll sit there forever until you pick it up. Or at least until you walk away and it probably clears. We made it back to the helicopter. All good and alive. Uh, we're going to look at some of the stuff we got. We got 135 fingerless gloves. We technically don't have to upgrade to those since they really aren't an increase in gear level. And I do like the Oakley ones. So we'll go ahead and keep that. We got a plus five in the pants and a plus, plus six in the, in the boots with the Oakley boots. Oakley LSAs. Uh, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the weapons we got. We got another M4, which is putting us at 134. So if we want to do some uh, close quarter stuff, we got the Vector and the M4. Another sniper rifle, a shotgun, and a submachine. Uh, yeah, a submachine gun. So they're really not doing too many um, rifles for me, which is a little bit odd. Uh, then again, I am picking the area, so they're just... But they're not giving any rifles. Which is just definitely different because I usually get a lot of rifles. Uh, so I'm going to find another location that we could do and see if we could possibly find a rifle. This place just uh, down from where we were at actually doesn't look too bad at all. I flew in a little too close, so I think they're going to start wandering the area a little more than I would like them to. But I will show you why this area will be pretty nice uh, in the long run. Why aren't you... Oh, they're walking right up on me, dude. Right up on me. I gotta get this one first. Okay, one down. He didn't hear anything. No one else heard a thing. I gotta go fully automatic so that way I can just take him out quickly. Seems legit. Their dialogue. He's down. I think he went down behind the rock, so I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get him. So I'll again, I'll show you guys why I wanted to hit this place. Oh, two for one there. I didn't even know that there was another guy. Okay, let's grab this uh, pickup while we're here. They got a helicopter over there, but this will probably be my last little... Oh, inst <laughs> instantly the the assault rifle. And that's the, that's the one I really like, too. And we got M uh, Mark III on that as well. So that's why I wanted to come here. So we're going to get another 416 on top of the one that he just dropped. Uh, Scorpion, which is, I think, a submachine gun or possibly an assault rifle. A vest and a ball cap, 500 scale credits. So this is going to be a nice little area that we're going to work here. Uh, so what I should do is probably just throw on this new 416, which is a level 135. And probably get it better suited to my taste. Let's go ahead and throw on an uh, yep. extended mag, suppressor. We got the rangefinder, but I don't know how to work that, so it seems rather uh, pointless to me. And for the under, under barrel, we're going to do a vertical foregrip. I think that one looks pretty good on it. More lightweight, I guess you could say. Wow, I need one more. I need 15 metal parts. Uh, to be able to get this up to a Mark III. And I've been using this heavy, so what I should do is probably just get that up to where it should be. You know what I mean? Stop playing games. So let's go down here. We're going to dismantle. How much metal parts are we getting, too? So we're going to have to do this a little bit of times. It's unfortunate I got to get a, a rid of a lot of weapons, but if they're such low rank like that, there's no point in keeping them. Because I do use a pretty set, a standard set of weapons, or at least the assault rifle I use, and I'll switch that second uh, one no problem. So let's see if that will allow us to, boom, max level reached. That is how you do it. Did that allow us to, how do I unlock that though? I have most, if not everything else unlocked, but uh, for some reason that I don't. What other... Ooh, USP Tactical. I don't know. I like the USP. It's not a bad... Uh, 
not a bad gun. So we're going to go ahead and get that a little bit done up her with my stuff that I like to put on my guns. I wish I just had a preset that I can make. You know what I mean? Uh, that way it's just boom, boom. Okay, we're good to move up. We got a sniper. I think actually before I go ahead and do this, we're going to take that off. We're going to throw on the vector and we're going to mess people up with this. This is a beautiful gun and I mean, literally is, is just amazing. Uh, let's get a suppressor. I do like that panoramic sight, though. And let's see if... I don't think I have enough parts to fully get this upgraded, but at least I could do some. I need more metal parts, but I'm not going to worry about that right this second. We're just going to move up and uh, see, what, see how this new level... 416 does. I would prefer the M4A1, but if they're not going to give me that, then at least the 416 looks relatively close to the uh, M4A1. These guys are going to be up and active, so we got to be a little bit careful. Somehow we automatic markered him. Wow, we alerted him, but he died before the full alert, so that was cool, I guess. Don't know how that happens. We should probably kill some of these lights. There we go. Scale credits is around the corner. Let's go ahead and get that guy so we can't boogie out of here. Damn, this gun's rate of fire is just absurd. Wonder if I could shoot this. Nope. Only 300? I worked that hard. Which was like not even hard at all. Or nothing. We got a guy on the yonder. Two guys. Oh shit, hold on. One of them's the uh, reinforcement, so we're going to definitely want to get him. Alright, we're going to get the reinforcement guy. He's walking right towards us. Okay, fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, he didn't see me. I gotta retreat a little so I can get a position. Okay, he's down. I think we saved ourselves a little. We've got a sniper that's a little bit alerted to what's going on over here. I don't know where the fuck he's at. There he is. He's down. Okay, thankfully we were able to get the sniper. I think we might have just saved ourselves because the sniper saw the drone and then he was about to alert everyone. I can't see anything around this, so I'm going to get around it. Oh yeah, people are moving up. We got to be careful. They are... Oh, what? I didn't, I don't know how I didn't get him. I don't know how I didn't get him. And this is a higher level than the other one. Could probably reload this vector, get it back in the fight. Feeling a little lonely without it. I need that rate of uh, fire. Yep. Like I said. We got a guy moving. Ooh, guy to the right. Sniper. Oh my god! Mortars! Mortars up! Mortars up! How How is a mortar up? Fuck, I'm out of ammo on the... Vector. Okay, these guys must be a higher rank because they are taking bullets after bullets. Where is this mortar guy? I need to get him. He's going to mess up someone's day real quick. He's back here.
Yeah, there you are. Automatic frickin' mortar. Because that's the coolest thing ever. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh. A truck or something just moved up. He was not shooting at me before, but he started shooting right now. Okay, someone's hitting me up from that side. We're taking the silencer off. You wanna... Talk shit, go ahead. I don't know where this guy had a 50 cal, but he was shooting me with a 50 cal. Oh, it's this guy. It's the heavy. Ah! Can't get over the barrier. I don't even know how I got him. Seriously, though. We, like, at this point, like, what the hell? Alright, we're gonna do our collection. That's how you do it. I mean, it, it, I, I, there's, there's, like, no worry about if we get into some shit on the ground and a sniper thing. Let me get all the stuff that's on this higher level before we jump down there. But yeah, I mean, that's, uh, that's why it's nice playing a game consecutively. You could really, oh, there's still some people here. Oh, you know what? He's by the helicopter. I know exactly where he's at. Yeah, but he thinks we vanished, so we're good. Did I get any vector ammo? Like 45 rounds, which is nothing. Oh, he's close. I think he's making his way down. Oh yeah, we're scoring so much stuff. He's up behind these rocks somewhere. He's stuck behind a rock. That was sloppy. But yeah, I think he was he was either waiting for me or just stuck behind a rock. One of the two. That's a guy that did a lot. Wait for his whole squad to die. And then he's like, I, I, I see him. I'll get him. No, you didn't. You died. Just like everyone else. We got one more crate. It's going to be on the low. Two more crates. It's going to be on the lower level. I believe one of them is still going to be the 416. So I'm pretty interested to see what level they're going to give for that. Since they don't tell, technically tell you uh, what level you will reach when you go for these guns. But it is cool that they show you what guns you will be uh, receiving. And it's just also cool that you get Mark 3s uh, if you just unlock that. They'll just consecutively give you that for every every gun you get of that. So if you really have a gun you like, if you come across it again, at least you'll have it in its best form possible. This is going to be the 416. 139. Wow. Okay. That works for me. And again, we're just going to go through and do some... Quick adjustments to it. Panoramic sight is what we want. Paint. Get that. Well, that's cool. And we might as well get this other stuff. Plus seven for the ball cap. Damn. And I like how it doesn't change it because uh, we have override on. So we can kind of stick with uh, what we like. Except for some stuff. It will change it. Yeah, there you go. Level 139. We're almost to 150, and 150 is kind of like the basis. I know it goes up higher than that. I really don't know where it stops. Uh, but I'd say we're at, we're at a pretty damn good gear level uh, for not even having the game out for that long. I'd probably say it's been out for maybe like a solid month and a half or something. I really don't know. Uh, but that's going to be where we wrap this one up. Just doing some ammo collection. They got some type of like locked room here, I think. They got something somewhere. Or maybe it's up. I don't know where it's at, but they got like uh, one of those rooms that have a whole bunch of explosives and stuff like that. Uh, but that's going to be where we wrap this one up, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode of Ghost Recon Breakpoint, and we will see you next episode. Hey.